Welcome to the Ameridroid Mini Lab slash Electrical Closet. Today I will be showing you how to power an Odroid and a Raspberry Pi from a 5 volt power supply through the pin header here. Alright, so first I prepared a cable lead from my 5 volt power supply over here. Now if you look at the Odroid, this is mounted to a touch screen, just so you know what that is. Uh, that's not necessary for this demonstration, but just the way I have it. So you can see a 1 there and a 2 over here. So as you go this way, I'll be counting up. So these pins are 2, 4, and 6. 2 and 4 are both 5 volts, and 6 is ground. So that makes it really convenient. The red on this I have hooked up to positive. So I'm going to... By the way, I stole this out of an old computer case, as you can see. Um, I'm going to hook that up to the, the red line to 4 and the white line to 6, so that's uh, power and ground. Then I'm going to turn on my power supply, and you'll see it's starting to pull power, and uh, the light is powering up there. So as soon as that starts blinking blue, that means that it's loading. So this Odroid C1 is being powered by nothing other than that pin, those two pins on the header. Now we'll do the same thing with the Raspberry Pi. Okay, so now again all we have is Raspberry Pi 2 here. We will again, same pin out on the Raspberry Pi 2. We'll connect it up between pins 4 and 6. 4 being 5 volts and 6 being ground. And again, turn on the power supply. And you'll see the Raspberry Pi is now booting up. So either one can be powered in this method. The same method also would apply to uh, Banana Pi um, or other boards that have a Raspberry Pi compatible pin header. Alright, that's it for today. Thanks. Thanks.